Hey, um, welcome back to my channel. For those returning, um, for those new, this is School of Thoughts Tarot. Um, so for those of you who have been watching my videos, um, you know, I, I like start and then I stop and then I start again and I stop again. That's because life has taken me on a, y'all know how 2019 was and that was rough. Okay. And <clears throat> I've had a lot of stops and starts like in my own life so YouTube is just reflecting all the stops and starts um, that I've had so um, I apologize for that but I'm back because um, I will be more consistent this time I actually um, had a long we had many talks with spirit um, about what I'm doing what I'm supposed to do um, how to go about doing that so I've been led this lip gloss shiny I've been led to make like a lot of different like decisions okay a little too shiny it's real shiny the lamp is right there too so it's like reflecting off my lips sorry <laughs> um but yeah so <clears throat> i'm looking down because i have my papers in front of me but yeah so pretty much i'm back to say that this will be a consistent thing now and for those who don't know my name is andre nay i feel like i didn't say that but it's andre nay you call me nay everybody calls me nay n-a-y if you're gonna do n-e it needs to be the E with a thing over it. I'm gonna play that. It's not N A E. I don't know who the hell that is. Somebody just made that shit up and went with it. I don't know who, but it's not that. Um, anyways, <laughs> so I'm. This video is just to update you on my channels now. Going to like consist of how often I'm going to post. Um, for those of y'all who've been watching me, I gave in and got nails. Um, <laughs> I actually had a different set before this. I just went and got a fill-in, like, I guess I'm on that now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I like these. They're not that short. I mean, that long. They were longer before, but I think they're cute. They fit me, I think, anyway. But anyways, and this is an evil eye bracelet. So for all y'all who want to mug me and stuff for what I say, and da 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 back at you. But anyways. <laughs> okay, so... The first change is, um, so before I was trying out with like old collective reads and then I would try doing the love reads and I was doing it weekly, then I was doing it monthly, then I was doing like bi-monthly, I was doing a lot, okay? I have a new structure now, I have a new mojo, a new setup. So what I'm going to do is the first type of videos that I'm going to have on my channel are weekly collective energy and shifts reads. So with the weekly collective um, energy and shifts, it's just going to be... A weekly reading you know like normal like um this energy is for the collective what you should look out for what's gonna be happening like things you have to deal with whatever whatever for the collective right um those will be posted every sunday actually starting um this sunday which is the 19th i think yes starting the oh happy new year by the way um but yeah so starting the 19th um i will be having the weekly collective reads and then so I've got my love reads down packed too now, right? So for my love reads, I'm going to do them bi-monthly, okay? So they're going to be out the previous two weeks. So for example, I'm going to be recording the first half of February during the second half of January. And they'll be out before the first of February gets here. That makes sense, right? So second half of February, um, I'll be recording the first half of March. Makes sense because <clears throat> this is my second time making this video and the first time I was going through that 50 million times I could not get it to make sense but it makes sense okay so for the first half of February I'll be recording the second half of February easy right but yeah um so they're gonna be bi-monthly so first to the 15th 15th to 31st or whatever the month is you know and um yeah I will go in order of whoever's birthday season it is um will be the first video out and then I do have like <clears throat> astrology cards. Uh, let me see if I can. I have these astrology cards that have all the zodiac signs. It's convenient, right? So I just take these, I shuffle them up, and I literally draw off the top. And Sag came out, but this is just a video, so it's not going to be Sag first, but obviously, you know. Um, so that's how those will go. And those will be the only zodiacs i do okay because i heavily feel like it's more about the energy and where it's placed in your chart okay because i'm an aquarius sun and rising 
Um, I actually go by Vedic Astrology, so this will be Vedic. Um, not to say that if you watch your Western Astrology sign, that it won't resonate. Um, that's why I'm saying it's more about the houses and where the signs and planets fall um, as far as your houses. Because I'm Aquarius Sun, I'm an Aquarius Rising, and a Taurus Moon. But um, my Scorpio is very active. And I, don't, I only have Scorpio in my like eighth house or something. I don't even know all the specifics, honestly. Um, and then my Mars. Something to do with my Mars. I got Scorpio on my Mars or something like that. <laughs> Look, my friend's all into that stuff. I'm learning, um, but I'm not as in-depth as she is quite yet. Um, but yeah, so like my Scorpio energy is very prominent. Um, and as, well, as, as far as like Mars too, because like um, people who read me say that my energy comes off as fire. Fire and Scorpio. And I'm literally an air sign. So... Um, I really feel like it all depends on, um, you know, your houses and where they fall. Also, Vedic is just a bit more accurate than Western astrology. So I do go by Vedic. Not to say there's anything wrong with Western because there's not. Um, spirit finds ways to get through to everybody in whatever way they can receive it. So if you like Western astrology and you watch these for your Western um, sign, that's fine. If you do Vedic and you watch for your Vedic sign, that's fine as well. I'm an Aquarius and Western and Vedic, so it'll be good maybe to look up your Vedic sign. Matter of fact, I'll put a link. Let me write that down. But yeah, typically your Vedic sign is going to be the sign before you. But I'm just so deep into Aquarius that I'm still an Aquarius. So like my birthday is February 14th. Um, and the end of Aquarius is like February 18th. So like I'm really deep in it, you know. But typically if you're like, so if you were like a January Aquarius, um, you probably just call uh, Capricorn. So that's how that works. Um, but yeah. So it's going to be that change as far as love. And I'll explain when I will get that out. And then I will also have. So this is new. This is actually something Spirit um, led me and told me to do. Sorry. I make my own tea so I got boiled water. I'll put some honey in there. I squeeze half a lemon. I put sugar because I need sweet and <laughs> um, ginger. And I'll add mint too sometimes just for the health benefits of it. Um, but I always add ginger. Ginger root too. I grate my own ginger and put it in my tea and it's delicious. And I just boil it all on the stove for like, well, I boil the water and then I'll keep it boiling, add the honey, keep it boiling, add the lemon boil still add the sugar and then like right as i'm grating the ginger it'll still be boiling but i'll turn the stove off as soon as i like finish adding the ginger because i don't want the heat to like burn away all the nutrients if that's a thing i don't know if it if that's a thing i just it works for me okay <clears throat> anyways <laughs> so this new part that i'm adding to my channel is actually going to be called lessons of the wise old sage and if you're wondering who the wise old sage is, yes, it's me. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm only 22, but um, apparently I've lived many, 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 many lifetimes. Um, and I am very wise. I'm very knowledgeable. Um, and my spirit is old. I have an old soul, so the wise old sage. Okay. Um, but yeah, so basically those are going to be like episodes. And there's going to be two parts to it. So the first part is going to be like a tarot lesson. The second part is going to be um, spiritual guidance. So when I say tarot lesson, I mean um, we'll go over the cards. Like I'll just pull one of my decks out or oracle cards or anything like that. And I'll just, um, you know, go through each whatever. Like so for one lesson might be about the suits. So like the wands, the cups, the pinnacles, the sword. Um, one lesson might be about the court cards. One lesson might be about numbers and numerology with the cards. Um intuitive interpretations things like that but they're only 15 minutes um for each video so they're not going to be super long lessons or anything like that it's going to be a quick little lesson over the cards whichever one you know and then that's going to be that and then the second 15 is going to be spiritual guidance so spiritual guidance is going to be like whatever y'all need to know or you know um because the goal is to raise the consciousness of all humanity right so um, i'm here to do that so um that's going to be probably one of the discussions is like raising consciousness and how we can do that. Um, how to be more in tune with Mother Earth and to give her her needs because um, she supplies us with ours so on how we can give back to her. 
um, <clears throat> uh, karma, psychic gifts and abilities, because um, I am actually tapping into my psychic gifts right now. And I actually take a class right now called Psychic um, Development. And it's cool, y'all. It's, like, really cool. Like, we did one um, activity where you had partners and you were back-to-back -back and you had, like, six crystals in your hands, six stones. They were stones um, in your hands, right? And your left hand is how you send. Your right hand is your receiving hand. So if I was the sender, I held all of them in this hand, I would pick one to send and it would be in this hand. The uh, On the other side, they had to put all their stones in the right hand because they had to, this was their receiving hand or something. I don't know. He, he explained it better than me. But anyways, you picked a stone and you sent it, right? But with your mind. So you're like, you would think about what, so say it was like a, um, say it's Jade, right? This is Jade. Say it was Jade. I'll put Jade in my right hand. I would close it. I meditate on it. I'm like Jade, Jade, Jade. I'll think of green things. I would say heart chakra. I would say love. I would be like, um, you know, stems, and I would think of all things green, right? And your person, your partner, has to pick up on it, you know. And then they would try to guess which stone you picked up because we all had the same six stones. So they would pick the stone from their hand, whichever one it was, you know. We did it with the stones. We did it with um flowers so like we just thought i just thought of the flowers so in my head i was thinking like um daisy and i just kept saying daisy 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 because i don't know flowers that much so i just picked the flower that i knew so i kept saying daisy 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 and they actually got it they was like is it a daisy i'm like yeah so like it's telecommunication is a real thing in case you were wondering um all that stuff that happened in movies and stuff like they didn't come from nowhere so this is just an attempt to wake you up you know what i'm saying to your gifts and your abilities and understand that it's all energy and we all have, you know, the power to tap into that. We all have the power to use more of our brains. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're really supernatural beings, but people don't, people think we're just 3D. But really, we're, we're so much more than that, right? <clears throat> so, yeah, there's that. Um, twin flames and counterparts. I know that's a heavy topic. You want to talk about that? <laughs> I'm the first one who don't want to talk about it, but <laughs> whatever y'all have to, you know, know is whatever I'll be led to discuss, so. That was just um, some ideas, overviews of what I'll be talking about um, in those. So like I said, they'll be called The Lessons of the Wise Old Sage. And they will be 30 minutes long. First 15 is tarot. Second 15 is spiritual guidance. Okay? Yeah. So that's what my channel is going to consist of. Like, I, Oh, and those will be out bi-monthly as well. So like the love reads are bi-monthly. Those will be bi-monthly as well. So you'll get two a month. Okay? Of those. <clears throat> so in all, you'll get four weekly readings. So you get at least one reading a week, but you'll have, um, for each month, you'll have four weekly collective readings. You'll have um, two love reads, and you'll have um, two lessons of the wise old sage. But yeah, uh, so that's my channel update as far as the structure of the channel. Um, and then I just want to mention some other things. I do have an Instagram. So my Instagram is called School of Thoughts Tarot, obviously, because that's what it's going to be called. And um, I do post weekly not weekly, daily messages, um, each day for the collective. So Monday through Friday, I'll pull some cards. Typically, I'll pull an oracle, I'll pull tarot, and then I'll have my crystals too. Whatever crystals I think will be good for you to carry that week or work with that week, I'll include those in the spread as well. Um, and then I'll post it in whatever spirit you know, wants to bring through. They bring through, through. They bring through for that day. And um, if you need help like interpreting it for yourself you know how it applies to your life and i can definitely help you with that just dm me you know um but yeah it is school of thoughts tarot and i also have my personal reads information on there um but uh, i did want to go over my personal reads i think i have memorized so my personal reads have also changed um from the beginning so my um the first option i have is one question, three cards, I believe is what I called it. One question, three cards, ask a question, get an answer. Simple as that, you know, no extra, nothing. Just ask a question, get your answer. I'm not going in depth. I'm not reading into it for you. I'm not having a conversation about it afterwards. Just saying. <laughs> and that one is 11, 11. And then the next one I have is a general overview. Um, so it's going to be just some insight and guidance, just a little bit of clarity to what's going on in your life. It's not going to focus on one aspect of your life. It is general. 
Um, so you take it how it resonates for you, whether it's for love, whether it's for career, finance, whatever it's for. It's just a very general read uh, for yourself. And I will <clears throat> provide, you know, some advice cards from Spirit. But I, like I said, like it's just for, I would recommend that people who just like, they know they're doing like, you know, the right thing or trying to do the right thing, but it's a little extra guidance. You know, it's a little bit more clarity on what's going on. And that one is 3333. And then I have... Um, past life, love, career, finance, all in one. And it's going to provide insight, guidance, advice. It's like full-blown, in-depth reading analysis of your life. What you need to do to do differently. It goes into your past life, what you're working on from your past life, what you brought to this life, and how it's affecting you now. Um, I do go into each aspect separately, so it'll be your past life first, love. I feel winded. <laughs> like I haven't been sitting here. winded I don't know why I feel so windy <laughs> but um black talk so fast but yeah it's gonna go through your past life in depth um your love life your career finances all that it's gonna give you advice what you're doing right what you're doing wrong um whatever whatever right very in depth that one is 55 55 okay and then I have like upgrade options so like if you want it to be over the phone so if you want me to call you and we can talk about it so whatever option you pick um if you want me to call you it's going to be an extra 20 on top of whatever it already charged right so you want the general one it's going to be 53 33 because you're at 20 to 33 33 makes sense and then i have if you want a video chat so um via skype zoom um facebook uh messenger or whatever that's going to be special though only if we agree to that don't go at me on facebook um don't be doing all that but um that's going to be an extra 30 if i'm not mistaken i'll put the correction down below if i'm wrong but i don't think i'm wrong so if you want to do like video chat about it again say you got the general that would be 63.33 makes sense and then if you get an emergency reading like emergency turnaround 24 hour turnaround at the may at the um Sorry, I'm looking at my phone. It's over there. I think it just lit up, though. But um, the basis, what was I saying? Oh, if you want, like, a really quick reading to be turned around for you, whichever reading it is, if you want it within 24 hours, it's an extra $50 because I have to put my life on hold to record your reading. So it's going to be an extra $50. Um, of course, only for immediate situations, you know, where you're very, it's a very urgent, right? Um, and, uh, yeah. Those are my readings, prices, um, and then I do take payment through Cash App, Venmo, um, Zelle, whatever works for you. Um, but yeah, so typical turnaround time is 72 hours, so within three days you will have your reading. And then if I, if you don't want like the extra upgraded option, all readings are just recorded and posted to an unlisted link on YouTube, and I will keep them up for a week. And that's it, a week, and then it goes away. Um, but yeah, so that's my personal readings, and those can be booked. You can book them through School of Thoughts, Tarot, on Instagram, or I have a website that I will also include down below um, where you can go to book your website, I mean your reading. Um, and my website is like a blog. It has my Instagram post on there. There's a little bit about me on there, um, my about section. Um, like I said, it's a blog, so I do write on there sometimes. Um, I need to like update it, actually, but it's a blog, so if you're interested in the blog, that too. But really, there's just the link. Um, if you go to the little the top little lines and click it, it's going to say book a reading, okay? Matter of fact, let me get my phone to show you guys. Um, Because what I'm going to do is... um. Oh, I have a link tree. So on my link tree, I have like all these different links for myself. One of the links is my blog. So if I'm put my link tree below. And if you just press the link tree button, then it'll take you right to, um, it'll take you all to all the links. And it'll be like my YouTube channel, my website, all that stuff, okay? But um, let me show you my website. <sighs> so this is what the link tree looks like. Sorry, the light is making it very hard. But um, there's the tarot YouTube, tarot Instagram, and tarot, what's that say? Oh, website blog. 
Website blog is the last one. It's going to take you there. I have a mole on my thumb. Um, but yeah, so you see the little things in the corner? Press that. I can't see this, this light. I wonder if I turn the brightness up, what'll happen? Oh, that made it worse. <laughs> wow, I'm trying to get this slow. There it is, turn the brightness down, okay. So you see book you're reading? I pressed the wrong one. You'll see, go to this page, that's book you're reading. You'll enter your name, first name, last name, email, words type of message you'll enter your question your inquiry whatever whichever reading you want um and press submit and then there's instructions as far as like submitting payments and then there's also a list of my services at the bottom so that's where you have the one card and then you have the general you have the love finance career um past life upgraded phone upgraded video and then upgraded um, emergency reading. So, yeah, that's how you book a reading if you're interested. Um, <clears throat> like I said, 72 hours turnaround time. And then also on my link tree, I just wanna plug myself real quick cause I have to, nobody else gonna do it for me. Um, also on that link tree, if you were looking at the very top, it says poetry Instagram. So I do do poetry, I have an Instagram, it's called Poetic mystics that's p-o-e-t-i-c-m-y-s-t-i-c-s um and on there i do post poetry because i do poetry um i'm starting to open mics and stuff too i've also started learning to play the guitar and um i do sing so once i can get my own music off the ground and things i'll have that included as well with like a soundcloud link and stuff but um if you're interested in poetry i would love if you would support me and go check it out just like a poetry and go follow me i mean if you want to follow me that's great and everything but um no pressure um but yeah so that's pretty much it i just wanted to update you guys on what's going on and what's to come so i hope you're all excited because i am um i've gone through a lot to get to this point and people who've been watching me y'all seen my set change like many times this is going to be it until um i'm moving back to new orleans so for those of y'all who know i went to school in new orleans I'm um, actually moving back. I'm not sure when yet. It's going to be between now and August is when I'm moving back to New Orleans. So um, between now and then, my set will change. And that might put a delay on the videos, but if it gets to that point, then I'll let you guys know, okay? But yeah, so any questions, um, follow me on Instagram. You David me. Y'all can do whatever, okay? Anything at all. But yep, so I will see you guys on Sunday. Thank you so much if you watched this far. Love you guys and see you later.